Well, we're gonna try this again here. The phone just jacked up, said something went wrong. Your video is not saved. It's bright out. It's on my shit. It's getting slightly annoying because I had to unload all this just so I could take a shower because the shower head's right there. That door opens first. So I gotta unstrap the box. Well, I gotta move all that because the bottom of the door will hit all my metal. Yeah, took a shower last night, felt pretty good. Uh, it's like 80 yesterday. It's warm now too. It's the old campsite for the night, real nice. Real quaint. It's an abandoned federal mogul factory. Because we don't make things in America anymore. Which is bullshit. Wouldn't you agree, pilot? Yep. He agrees. Let's get some coffee. I don't know who's got a dog, but if you do, these are great trash bags. Great trash bags. I let my asparagus go bad. Whoops. <clears throat> Dirty sink. Nice. Everything else is like halfway clean though. Yo, that discount apple pie though. Whew, can't beat it. Oh, there's still coffee left in there. Whoops. Where's Pilot? Okay. He's on the attack. He heard something. <clears throat> he doesn't realize it's my coffee. Or he will. This held up. This is held up okay. All those glue seams holding up, doing okay. Well, bless your pilot. The rest of the van is quite a mess as well. Oh well. Countertops are clean though, I wiped those down. Look at that reflection. Oh, it's, uh, it's a little bit rough having to be so dang warm. It was like 60 something last night. Like last night, middle of the night, 60 something degrees. Oh, coffee's good. What are you doing, bud? Hmm? You don't want that. I promise. This guy has a tough time in the heat. He's got all this freaking fur. Huh. Huh. Look, he's like panting already and it's like not even warm out. It's like 8 a.m. It's supposed to be like 85 today. But yeah, the um, the fans up there, they they work. But man, when it's that freaking warm out, it ain't doing a whole lot. So I had made homemade popsicles. A pile of a huge fan. Um, we're gonna go sit back here. I need to wash the van. I haven't washed it in like a year. No, that's wrong. I got it washed. <clears throat> oh, golly. Gotta flip the phone, because as I've bitched about before, 
for some reason, you can't flip the camera um, while taking a video, which blows my mind. You can do it in an app, but you can't do it on the phone. Like, that makes no sense to me. Like, the technology is there. Like, it's, like the phone's capable of doing it. It does it. But only sometimes. Uh, I made homemade popsicles. It was, like, phenomenal. Uh, I need to go get popsicle sticks. Because I repurposed the popsicle sticks from the actual popsicles that I bought. They're on sale. They're, like, three bucks, maybe, something like that. And there were the no sugar added outshine popsicles. They were good, tasty, not a bunch of sugar in them. I saved my sugar for that maple brown sugar apple pie that was on discount. Um, <laughs> what are you doing? Well, anyways, I repurposed those popsicle sticks and just put them in an ice tray. I got one of those silicone ice trays. Um, I put the popsicle sticks in it. Oh, the whole reason about the real popsicles. They wouldn't stay frozen. They were that mushy bull crap where, like, even if you tried to open the package, it would smush the popsicle. I don't know, like... My freezer, it'll keep ice. Like, it makes ice. It's like, it gets things frozen, but I feel like it needs, like, more than just, like, 30 degrees or something like that. Like, like a popsicle needs to be, like, 20 or 10 or 0 or I don't know. And that fridge is clearly not capable of keeping stuff that cold. I'm pretty sure it's on the max setting, too. for coldness um, I put popsicle sticks in a silicone ice tray and then I put coconut water in it I had some of the press stuff like it's kind of like milky and white um, and then I had some pineapple flavored there was six cube spots so I did three with the press three with the pineapple and then I smashed up raspberries and I put it in one. I put whole raspberries in another one. I smashed up strawberries and put it in another one. And then I just sliced strawberries and put it in another one to figure out how I wanted to have my popsicles. And smashed is the way to go. Uh... I put those in there. I fill, uh, pretty much like filled the little cube tray. And they're like decent size ice cubes. Or the tray's decent size. They're like that wide, but like that tall. They're, they're pretty big. And by that wide, I mean like they're square. Cube. Um, so tried that out and it was, it was freaking awesome. It was great absolutely gonna do that again and it was just those two things coconut water and fruit that's it uh it was refreshing it was cold so that's good um because it was hot yesterday i didn't make any for today because i don't have any more coconut water but i even gave one really probably like one and a half maybe two uh, to pilot, he loved it. Um, I I got those ice cube trays for him because he likes ice. Um, it was a two pack. I I couldn't only buy one, and I'm glad I didn't throw the first one out right away, or the second one out right away. I I got I made it came with the balls, and then the the cubes, and the balls obviously have a top and I'm like I'm gonna put that one in the freezer because shit won't spill because it's got a top that's making weird noises pilot go check that out what is that 
this uh, some drug addict in the abandoned factory. I think we're the only ones here. I don't know. I don't even know what you guys are looking at. Hopefully, I mean, not hopefully me, but possibly me. Maybe just looking at the back of the van. Got no way of checking. Good luck. Uh, where was I going with this? Ice cubes, ice cube tray. Oh, I used the round ones first. Uh, and this was a while ago. I just never got the ambition to make the popsicles. Because it wasn't really that hot out. Um, but I did have the idea to do the popsicles after the first hot day like four weeks ago. It was a random day. It was like 80 something. And uh, that's when I went and got the ice cube trays and made ice for pilot. I don't really have a need for ice. Maybe, I, I don't know. Maybe I will then? I, I don't know. Anyways, so I kept that silicone ice tray in the Tupperware drawer and it was bothering me because it was taking up space and I was on the verge of tossing it, but I'm glad I didn't because it's like, it's nice now, but the downfall, let me show you this, let me show you. downfall oh dear almost fell backwards uh is that my entire freezer is taken up by ice trays the i'm talking the entire freezer oh my god those aren't frozen well I now have smaller ice cubes. But yeah, I need to clean that up now. Uh, I mean, it keeps them frozen, man. Like those are frozen ice balls. If I push that one all the way back and I put my regular ice cubes back, golly, it's a freaking mess. Gosh. Well, I guess there's a little bit of room. Not much. Like, half a hand length. Maybe a hand length. Maybe. Like, from that area back. Yeah. Oh, well. Hey, I need to clean this. Uh, that's a decent amount of water I need to clean up here. I'm gonna go. Have a good day, folks. <laughs>